This is what a port in a crisis looks like. Dozens of cargo ships have been waiting to dock off the Los Angeles Long Beach Container Terminal. With the current bottleneck, every ship has to wait about 10 days before it can be unloaded. It is a historic and unprecedented number. Much of what we've seen is the American consumer who've, who is not spending on services because of the COVID environment uh, are spending on durable goods. Under COVID, there has been an uptick in consumer demand, and that demand is still high as the U.S. economy recovers. This bottleneck is also due to supply chain disruptions, with most of these cargo ships arriving from China, where port activity was slowed down by the pandemic. Trucks hoping to get the containers out often have to leave empty-handed and return the next day. Last night I was there from um, 8 o'clock to 3 in the morning and I couldn't get the, the, the kick me out. Delays started shortly after the pandemic, with many businesses failing to have their orders delivered. We placed orders for new models back in May of last year and never, never got most of those until now, which is what, September, almost a year and a half. Things are unlikely to improve now that Christmas is looming. Delays have pushed prices up for companies renting containers. Last year, a 40-foot container cost $3,200. Now it's a bidding war. It's gone up to $22,000, $23,000. That price hike is likely to be passed on to consumers.